Hello, welcome, brothers and sisters in Christ. I have a message from the Lord. The Lord gave me this message on the 12th day of December 2017 at about 7.03 p.m. The Lord told me, tell my children that I am coming for humans who are created in my own image and likeness. People are now losing their humanity. I created humans, male and female. Anything more or less than this is not from me. I am the Lord. Extraterrestrial beings are not humans and nobody should desire to be like this like these that are from other worlds. Extraterrestrial beings are demons who are on earth to deceive people. People who lose their humanity are condemned already. Want my church that nobody should take the mark of the beast. It destroys the humanity of men, both in their heart and will. I have spoken that men may learn. This is the word that the Lord gave to me. When God created the whole world, He created them male and female. Whosoever loses the humanity, the image and the likeness of God is liable to face the judgment of God. They will not go and punish. If you are doing surgery to change from female to male, you can't change your brain. Because the male brain and the female brain are different. In fact, you can decide to do a reassignment of your sex organs. You can take steroids, but you can change your brain. There are things you can change. So it doesn't make you to become a male or it doesn't make you to become a female. If you are created a female, you remain a female forever. If you are created a male, you remain a male forever. In fact, uh, about two days ago, the Lord was telling me about bodybuilders, that many of them have become monsters and that they can't enter his kingdom. I'm going to release the whole of that message, probably next week. Please, you need to mind your business in this world and make sure nobody pollutes you. There are, when you look at the world, people do a lot of makeup. Makeup to look like not to look not like God, but to look like other creatures, extraterrestrial being. And I see people also put on the snouts of animals, the ears of animals. You are a human. You are abusing the image of God. Somebody gave you his image. You have to protect that image, even if you don't respect yourself. You have to do all within your power to respect yourself. And people are glad, are glad, they want freedom, they need technology, and they are being deceived. You don't want to lose your money. You are being deceived. You have been deceived. You don't want to lose your job. You have been deceived. Please do not take the mark of the beast. It's coming in different forms. In different forms, but in major forms. I tell you the truth. Satan has started deceiving people. It is already here. It is here. What, what is holding it now is because what is making it from coming official is because Jesus has not appeared. Immediately Jesus appeared, it's going to be terrible, everything is going to change. If I, that was, I think yesterday, yes, yesterday, the Lord was telling me that immediately Jesus comes, that there is going to be a global movement for peace and the world leaders will gather together and before some will get home the antichrist will arise please let us open our eyes and watch he's already here and nobody is listening it's like i am mad me that is seeing those things and warning the people it's like i don't have my senses because i have those in the world who do miracles and different signs and wonders and never mention these things to them. So they feel, I am so strange and my message is strange. It's far away from the truth. But this is the word of God. This is God's own word. Please repent. When you want to do makeup, please, 
If you do your makeup and you look like people in the other world and you don't look like God, you will go to hell. Your makeup will take you to hell. Tell the people that their makeups will take them to hell. Go to Ego Eye Opener and you read what the Lord has revealed to me about artificial eyelash. Nobody wants to listen. Nobody, nobody is listening. Please save your soul from hell. Save your soul. Save your soul. Stop worshiping your flesh and save your soul. Invest in heavenly things and save your soul. If not, the whole of your body that you worship and do all the makeup on, you will see that same body in hell and you won't be able, you won't be able to do sex reassignment, sex organ reassignment. You won't be able to do that, but you will ask God, for forgiveness and when God doesn't forgive you in a thousand years in two thousand years you will turn against God and insult God with your own mouth why do you want to wait for that please repent the Lord is coming thank you God bless you you can subscribe if you wish subscribe but I encourage you to subscribe and also visit my websites egoeyeopener.com and also biblicalsexualpurity.com thank you God bless you